Hey everybody, this is Sasha Loju again, coming with another DMEC video, and here we're going to show the use of the S-Stamp. This S-Stamp has been placed by the iBank. Um, what they do is they remove the anterior cap, and then they place the S on the stromal side of the graft, and then they replace the anterior cap. So here you can actually see it. So after it's been taken out of the container, placed on the trephination block, you can see it once again. And even after you stain it with tripan, um, it'll still show up initially. So here we're basically removing the last segment that's been attached to the stroma and then placing it back down and then you notice that it starts to assume the correct uh, folding confirmation. So we perform surgery by doing two paracentesis, one main wound temporally, Strip the decimase membrane and endothelium and remove it from the eye. Make sure your pupil is nice and constricted. So here <coughs> I've got the the graph that's been sitting in tripan. I place it in the eye wall cartridge as shown there. And then we <coughs> get our eye wall cartridge opening into the eye. Once it's fully in, we shallow the chamber and then we try to use gentle puffs of BSS to try to move our graft in. This is a little more traumatic than we'd like, but it gets in there. Once it's in, we uh, shell the chamber more to decrease the pressure inside the eye. This helps prevent the graft from extruding out of the main wound. Despite that, we notice that it still kind of has a tendency to want to come out, so we use a little bit more puffs of BSS and um, use the second instrument to help prevent that from coming out. We place a suture in the main wound, and then we deepen the chamber a little bit, but not too deep, and then we start unfolding our graft. So here we're basically unfolding, and we think that we have it in the correct conformation as it's going, and once we get right at this point, we notice the S, which is actually at about 10 o'clock, and we notice that it's actually backwards, as you can see right there. This may be a little bit difficult to see in the video. But, so at that point, we know that the graft is upside down, so we have to deepen the chamber, allow the graft to scroll up on itself, as we can see there, and then we have to use uh, puffs of BSS to essentially roll the graft into the correct conformation. So once we think we have it there, we then uh, shallow the chamber, and basically tap on the cornea and use fluid currents to help unfold our graft. And once it's unfolded, we see nasally at about 2 o'clock that we do have an upright S there, which we'll see in a little bit. And once it's centered properly, bubble to lock it into place. And here's doing 100% fill. And then while we're waiting, here's a zoomed in view of the S, letting us know that we have the correct confirmation and we can now sleep well at night. Alright, thanks for watching.